Panel, we can tell you that Colonel Sanders is self-employed and deals in a product, and we'll begin the general questioning with uh, Arlene Francis. Colonel, I don't know what you do, but I think you look too beautiful to work. <laughs> I do plenty of work. Is your product anything that I might use? Yes, ma'am. I hope you do. Is it any product that I could hold in my hand? Yes. Uh, is it anything that I would put into my mouth? Yes, indeed. Uh, I would eat it or drink it? You would eat it. Thank you, Colonel. I know you're a Southern gentleman now. Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. I am your host, Asaf Adonai. Welcome to another segment of Asaf Adonai Stories. What's My Line is a panel game show that ran on CBS for 17 years from 1950 to 1967. The game uses celebrity panelists to question contestants in order to determine what the contestants do for a living. Our guest on today's ASAF stories was synonymous with What's My Line, one of the stars of television's golden age, a Broadway actress, one of America that came to know her from the game show. We're talking about Arlen Francis Kazanjian, known to the world as the one and only Arlene Francis. Arlene, born 1907, was an American actress, radio and television talk show host and game show panelist. She hit her stride with her most iconic role as panelist for the game, What's My Line, for a total of 25 years from 1950 to 1975, both on the network and in syndication. Born in Boston, Massachusetts, she attended the Baccalaureate Women's Finch College in Manhattan. She made her movie debut in a movie called Murders in the Rue Morgue with Bella Lugosi and Sidney Fox, spelled S-I-D-N-E-Y, who was a lovely actress in her own right. Arlene appeared in the Mercury Theater production of Dantos Death with Orson Welles, and she also did a movie called Journey to Jerusalem. Beginning in 1950, What's My Line was a regular on Sunday night fixture for CBS. It was hosted by John Daly, and the game became the longest running game in television history, winning three Emmy Awards for Best Quiz Show from 1952, 53, and 58. Finally, Arlene's highlights, she hosted the 30-minute radio game show of What's My Line, and she appeared in the 1940 radio soap, Betty Bob. So this is just a flyover in the life of Arlene Francis. She was warm, elegant, just a classy, fashionable lady, but she'll always be remembered for What's My Line. I am your host, Asaph Adonai, and until our next show, Maranatha. Arlene, sounds to me as if you might have a whole new career ahead of you as a musician. Oh, dear, I hope not. <laughs> I've, I've only been studying two months, and 802 has already turned me down. <laughs> I see. Well, as they say on television, we just happen to have a trombone here. <laughs> and uh, I may knock it apart getting it out of here. I'll but... take my lipstick off. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I'll take mine off, then. Okay. Uh, we just happen to have this thing here, and uh, we, could you show us what you've learned? <laughs> now, you do all understand it's been a very short period, and this is the most difficult instrument, no matter what it, anybody it is tells tough. you. <clears throat> However, I have a B-flat down flat, I oh, think. Can we hear it? Well, I haven't warmed up at all, you know, and I may not hit it off, but don't go away. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.